guys, going to check my box if my mystery tackle box came today. I hope it is. I've been waiting all week for it. So hopefully it's the day it came. Let's check. Oh my god, it's here. Okay guys, mystery tackle box. Next time you see me, I'll be unboxing it in front of you guys. So adios, see you when I open. Hey everybody, and as you can tell, you already saw what came. It's my mystery tackle box. Well, all the fancy YouTubers are down in iCast, I'm going to be unboxing my mystery tackle box. So I'm going to get right into it. This is the month of July. I have not opened it yet. Super pumped. I've been waiting all week. Here, got the bait card. Looks like first, we got a frog. It's called the Chugging Frog from Throwback Lures. Let me get that out of the package. Does it say the color? It says weed color. But I don't know if that's what it's really called. Oh my gosh, it's super soft. I only have one frog, so I'm super excited. Hopefully it works. There it is, right there. I'm so pumped about this thing. Got that big mouth to push water all the way. It's really realistic. Look at them eyes on that. This got one strand of that. It's not like usually like they got one here and here. Very sharp hooks. So I'm really pumped about this thing. Because I want to get into frogs. So we got the frog. Then we got an excite bait. This is a square bill. Guys, I'm sorry if there's a glare on there. I think there is. I will eventually fix that. I'll actually fix it right now for you. I think that's better. Can you guys tell now? I think there's still a glare on there. If you guys like that video I did on the wacky worm, if you like that outside, I can do more videos outside for you. Because then, I don't got all the light shining on me. But there is also that, so it's going to reflect a lot of light. But, here's a square bill. It looks like it's a bluegill. This dives 2 to 5 feet. And the color is... It does not say the color. Maybe it does. Yes, bluegill color. This will be my third or fourth square bill I have now. And I'm caught a fish on the square bill, but I want to. I mean, I don't get out fishing very much. And if I do, I have to bike. And that's just the local ponds, and they're really not the best. They're pretty. A lot of people fish them. They're pressured. Then we got Tungsten Hot Shack. Mr. Finest. Is this it? This must be it. I think so. Yeah, tungsten pro split shots. You can see that. I really have no idea what you do with these. This is a finesse special. I have no idea what you do with them. It's just a little ball. I, don't, I think it says back here, you just like wrap your line around it. Simple wrap your around simple wrap your line around the split shot as shown. Then they got a little picture. So that's cool. I mean I'll have to give them a try. I wish I could tell you what they're used for, but I really have no idea. Oh, I forgot to tell you the prices of these. I'll just leave them. I'll put them in the video where you guys can just read it. Cause I forgot to tell you. Next we got premium extra wide gap drop shot hooks. These look pretty cool. I really want to get into drop shotting too. I do plan on it. I mean I plan on getting some drop shot worms. The plasma tails from Biospawn. These are some pretty small hooks actually. But you don't need big hooks. You guys can see that. Ah, crap.
Well, yeah. As you guys know, I'm sitting here, not at iCast. Wishing I was. But maybe when I'm older and I have, I can drive. Um, this is size 4. There's 6 of them in here. It even shows you how to tie it on the back. How to tie it. Then we got Fork Pin by VMN Bates. This is a four pack. This is actually a big package for this. I really don't know what kind of worm these are. I mean, honestly, I really don't know. You could throw it in and then let it drop to the bottom kind of or guys you gotta I just started bass fishing not that long ago so I really don't know as much but I mean that might be too big for a drop shot I really don't know so if you guys do know what this is for let me know and I thank you very much but this is a four pack looks like watermelon with red flake Pretty good color in my experience with Senkos, so it's going to be a good color with them. Then we have one more thing. It is Baitmate Fish Attractant. I've never used Baitmate. I've never used any attractants. I just use... I really don't use attractants. But I don't know how it works if you just, like, open it up, squirt it on your thing. Apply directly onto any live or artificial bait for best result reapply frequently to maintain consistency so yeah you just like take your bait I don't know what you put it on here but I mean sure you can squirt it on here but that's not gonna work very well it's used for live or artificial bait so you just squirt it on this and you give it smell I don't know what smell this is doesn't that say the smell Hmm, well, that's cool. I'll give all this stuff a try. I've never used any of this stuff. I'm super excited about the frog. Excited about the crankbait. Excited about everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Ah, crap. One more thing. We have the scratch off. Let's see what our prize is. Or would be. It would be a hoo-ha bandana. Let me scratch the first three okay not looking good at all so we got a grub a crankbait and a bobber we got another crankbait another bobber and a crawfish we didn't win that sucks And then we got a sticker. I'll probably put this on my tackle box. Because it's a pretty cool sticker. And then you got your Dibble Digest. Pretty cool stuff in here. This one. Dynamite baits for flipping and pitching. I've never flipped and pitch for, ugh, pitched. Sorry about that. But that would be cool to try. Talking about the MTB Slam contest. It's where you take out your take out all your baits on the water and catch a fish on every one. Beginner's Guide Fishing Spoons. Mystery Tackle Box Pro. Then they're talking about buzz baits. It's pretty cool. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I plan on having this uploaded Friday, which is today. Then I mean Monday, Friday, just keep doing that like that. I mean, do you guys want an MTV Slam? I really don't have a lot of local... I mean, I have local ponds, but they're really not be the best. I can take them out and try them if you guys want to see that. Hopefully, I can catch all fish on them. There's a good um, pond there for frogs. So, if you guys want to see that, make sure to leave a comment. Let's get this video to 10 likes. Once we start getting 10 likes on every video, we'll go 15. But, I mean, let's get 10. I hope you guys like, subscribe if you have not, and see you guys later. Adios.